Hello and welcome to episode 5 of our 72 hour game of tag, where each of us is trying to get to a different location in Europe before the other two can tag them. Right now, Ben is on his way to Zermatt, Switzerland with a huge lead thanks to a series of escalating setbacks for the chasers. See, as Ben made his way through the Netherlands, we wanted to go directly to Breda, a hub where we could cut him off, but his signal fault forced us to go a much longer route. Once finally in Breda, Ben was headed to Belgium. We wanted to take a train to Brussels, but discovered it made its first stop at 8.01, one minute after the rest period begins, meaning we weren't allowed to get on it. So instead we figured we'd go up to Rotterdam and take a high-speed train to Brussels in the morning. But then it turned out that train was sold out. So we have to wait to take a train when the game starts at 6am tomorrow morning. But this small train station doesn't have a train to Brussels until 7am the next morning. All of which is how Ben's 15 minute lead just turned into a 3 hour lead. And as you can tell, we aren't feeling amazing about it. This just seems impossible that it could be this bad. So now we get to Brussels at 9 a.m.? Yes. Three hours after the game starts? Yes. There's gotta be... That can't be right. Okay, let's... Okay. Off to Belgium, then. I didn't really think I'd get this far. So I'm feeling pretty good. I am going to get to the Brussels airport by the rest period. I'll be able to start from there tomorrow morning. When will Sam and Adam be able to get there? Who knows? They know, probably. Is there here. a bus or something? I'm, I'm, I don't think so. Is there a place that we could take a taxi to that would be useful? I don't think so. Are we sure, though? Stick with me for a second here. No. There's gotta be, there's gotta be something. My God, how is this possible? I don't think he's taking the news well. Oh. We could go get some dinner. Are we sure we've exhausted all our options? I mean, wait, wait, let me look. Okay, what if, what if we tried to go to Roosendal in, in Antwerp in the morning, potentially? We could. Okay, I'm just, just for starters, we could do that. Also, we could take a 29-minute car to Brecht. Okay, yes. Brecht is even better. Yeah, see, look. Brecht to Brussels tomorrow morning, 6 a.m. We get there at 7.36. Look. I think that checks out. Okay, so there's a lot going on here, so let's walk you through it. Basically, what Adam figured out is that the chasers can use our ability to take 30-minute taxi rides to go to a place called Brecht tonight. Brecht just so happens to have a train right when the game starts next morning to Antwerp, where we can then make a quick connection to Brussels. In total, this one little move will save us a whole 90 minutes. Which is why... We need to get on a, in a taxi to Brecht right now. So we hopped in an Uber and made it to the station just in time for the rest period. All right, we are at Norderkempen and we have reached the end of day two. Good night. Good night, see you in the morning. Meanwhile, Ben made it to Brussels airport. Coincidentally, the exact location where we ended day two last season. We are here at the Brussels airport. Someone on my train got arrested for smelling a lady's hair, so that's kind of interesting. Anyway, what is my plan? What's the plan? What is the plan? Great question. Here's Ben's plan. Luxembourg. It's in his wind region, and he has a lot of options from there. He's hoping to chain together a few trains to get there, with stops in Charleroi and Namur. But first, it's time to sleep. Okay. Good night. Mwah. So yada yada yada, rest period, and it's 6 a.m. the next morning. Ben gets on his train to Charleroi, we go to Antwerp, and just like that, the chase is back on. Okay, so headed to Brussels, but I think that's on. I think literally, it's literally this platform. Right there. Literally yeah. this platform. Welcome to Antwerp. It's a very cool train station. We should go look up. at that. Let's go up a level. Let's go look at it. I feel like this is one of those things that somebody would frame up really neatly in one of those really annoying, accidentally Wes Anderson like uh, videos. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Okay, say something in sort of a detached tone. Sitting on trains for two days wreaks havoc on your bowels. Yeah, I'm feeling good this morning. I mean, physically, terrible. I am on the brink of death, but 
game-wise, feeling pretty good. Because if I can get all the way to Luxembourg, my options really open up, and then I should be able to just like embed myself somewhere weird in my territory. Because um, I think at this rate, uh, no one's going to make it to their end location. I think the winner is going to be determined by where the runner is at the end of today, at 8 p.m. today. Just a quick reminder, if nobody makes it to their end location, the win goes to whoever's end location is closest to the current runner at the end of three days. This is day three, meaning that whoever's win region the runner is in at 8 p.m. today will win the game. But that just means that I have to get somewhere weird in my territory where they can't get to me. Um, and I, I feel like I should be able to do that, but we'll see. Okay. Okay. Hello. So Ben has left Brussels. He is headed, it seems, to a place called Charleroi. Uh, he will get there at 7.30. Uh, luckily, the train we are on to Brussels continues on to, what's it? What is it? Charleroi. Yeah. Uh, and we'll get there at 8.30. So we'll only be an hour behind him. That's good. Um, we frankly have no idea uh, where he's going. I mean, he seems to be probably planning to chain together regional lines to make his way into his territory, which, to be fair, is a very smart move. You, you can't cut somebody off if you don't know where they're going. <laughs> so, I think we just gotta follow him for now. We're doing fine. We're doing fine. I had a dream last night that Sam and Adam fell down a well, and I won. And when I went home, there was a parade uh, for me, and people were in the streets, they were crying, like tears of joy, like they were weeping. And Joe Biden was there, and he kissed me on the forehead, and he gave me a big key to the city. Um, and Sam and Adam were still down in the well. Was it a dream or was it a premonition? Only time will tell. We are here in Charleroi. I have about 15 minutes to transfer onto a train to Namur. There's my train. Okay. To Namur. have news. He's going to Namur, which we thought he might do, and we could have gotten off in Brussels and gone straight to Namur and gained a lot of ground on him, but we didn't. Uh, we didn't do that. He has a lot of options from Namur. Well, uh, most notably, he has a, d a direct to Luxembourg. It would be cool to go to Luxembourg. I mean, I would enjoy going to Luxembourg. Yeah, we can take, so we the, can 850. take the 850 and just be one hour behind. At a certain point, we can't be one hour behind, though. At a certain point, yes, we, have to certain catch point up. we do have to catch up. So, here's the situation. The situation is is interesting. The situation is entertaining. It's good, suspenseful entertainment. And that's what we're here for, right? This train to Namur gets in at eight twenty-two. There is then a train to Luxembourg at eight forty-seven, uh, which I don't have remotely enough coins to take yet. If I can earn a whole bunch of coins in like 25 minutes and get on that 847, that means that I will have bought myself, I think at least a two hour lead in Luxembourg, which would be amazing. And if I don't make that train, it means I'll probably get caught in Namur. So I have just got to pull a card as soon as I get off this train and pray, pray that it's something I can do really quickly. Okay, okay, we're in Namur. Uh, the train for Luxembourg leaves in 25 minutes. So let's pull apart. Okay, I'm using the last of my coins to double this next card. And 
I guess the fate of my run and the fate of this game uh, sort of come down to what card I pull. Okay, here we go. Become a French chef. Become a French chef. Make mayonnaise. You must successfully emulsify egg and oil into at least one tablespoon of mayonnaise. That's gonna be hard to do in 25 minutes. Oh, God. Oh, oh, the legs are burning. Oh, the legs are burning. It's a place called Shop and Go over there. Oil, oil, oil. Some kind of oil. I can get oil out of something else. Vinaigrettes. Yeah, there's oil at the bottom of this. That might me up, but I have no choice. Now see. Now I just have to emulsify. I just have to emulsify. Welcome to the French Chef. Today we're going to be making mayonnaise. Crack an egg into here. We're gonna get some oil. Yes. And then we're gonna be extremely vigorous about this. Uh. It's mostly paper right now. We're gonna pour this out and try again. Egg, the oil. Hello, all right, uh, we are in Charleroi. Ben is in Namur now. Uh, we remain an hour behind him. Basically, like, we need something to change. Like, we need something to happen that slows like, Ben down there, there in some way. Yeah, there doesn't seem to be much that we can really do to, to get like, in get front ahead of, of him. It seems mostly down to hopefully something messing up on his side. So hopefully we're cutting to him like vetoing a challenge or like Falling not in a ditch. Yeah, or not having enough coins or dying. No. Of embarrassment, because he does bad. Yes. Yeah. Oh, okay. It spilled out. Oh dear. This is bad. This is bad. Okay, we're gonna. Okay, looking at me. We're gonna throw this out. Okay. Found a cup in the trash. We're gonna try again. Egg. Oil. The train's leaving soon. Okay. Okay, okay. I think that that is sufficiently emulsified. It's completely mixed. So, oh, we're gonna throw all of this out. Okay, I'm cleaning off the rest of the egg. Uh, 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 oh, ew. Oh. Oh. Oh, I don't know how much time I have. I don't know what's happening. this. Oh. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, it's still here. All right, done. Merci. That's my train to Luxembourg. Looks like you didn't make it in time, boys. 
We're going to a new country. Uh, the train to Luxembourg leaves in three minutes, and he is, he is in the station. I do think he's going to go to Luxembourg. Which I don't love. I don't love that. Things aren't going great. I'm going to touch that wire. Yeah, I think you should touch it. It's, it seems to not. I don't think that's electrical. <clears throat> Couldn't get there. Just the wire. Nice. Let's get on the tom. Oh. Uh, I think we're leaving. Yeah. Yeah, we're leaving. Okay, let's freaking go. I have to finish washing off all my stuff. Oh, we gotta watch the camera too. But, okay, let's go find the seat. Oh, there he goes. Stuff. Oh, okay. All right. Well, I'm I'm trying not to freak out yet, but it does seem like he's going to enter his win area now. And it doesn't seem like we have a good way of catching up. I agree. All right. Well, welcome to Namor Station, where Thank you. you just saw Ben. Uh, I was talking to the audience, not you. Rude. Ben left, what, 18 minutes ago? But now we have to wait a half hour uh, to get on a train. So, welcome to Namur. It's a beautiful city full of construction, mostly. So it is 9.48 and Adam just tweeted something. And that suggests to me that they just got on a train. Cause like usually what I do is like, I'll sit down on a train, like a long train and I'll like pull up my phone and pull up Twitter. And that would make sense because there was a train one minute ago um, from Namur to Arlon. Um, and if they got on that train, they could get to Luxembourg by like 1150. Um, so I'm going to assume that that's what they're doing. And so I just have to get out of Luxembourg before then. I think that should be no problem. Welcome to Luxembourg. One of the toddlers in my car said, we're in Germany, France. And what, what is Luxembourg if not Germany, France? Uh, it seems like most of the routes I would take out of here go through a place called Metz. Already have enough budget to get there. Um, so I think what we're gonna do is we're just gonna pull a card see what the deal is, and then hop on a train to Metz. Sam, Adam. Ben is officially in the region where were the game to end right now, he would win. Okay, he could get to Metz on this train at 12-12. <laughs> that's, that's, that's a lot earlier than we could. When could we get to Metz? I mean, we're not even getting to our lawn until 11.30, and then we would need to take the train, and then we would need to take a taxi, and then we would need to take a slow regional train to Metz. Okay. If Ben gets on a train 14 minutes from now, headed south, then the game is potentially, okay. If there, if Ben gets on the train at 11.24, we are well and truly f***ed. Let's give him a little shuffle. And then we will see what we're doing next. Cursed, you are now being ratatouille The next move you make will be decided by a rat. Please access the Smithsonian Zoo's Naked Mole Rat live feed and go to camera two. Whatever direction you first see a rat cross the camera, you must travel at least two miles in that direction before continuing. Okay, 
I have to access the naked mole rat cam, and they're going to decide where I'm going to go next. We have to access cam two. Okay, so that rat just went that way. So I have to go west. Is Metz at least two miles west? No. No, it is not. So let's look at the departure board and figure out what we're allowed to take. Oh, okay, well, it's 11.25, and yeah. he's still there. I, but I feel like I'm just kind of setting myself up for heartbreak here. Probably. Uh, I've got a real, I've got, a, I've got, a, I've got like a pit in my stomach. He's, it still says he's in the station. Yeah. But why would, there's no reason he would be in the station if he wasn't taking that train. There's not another train for like 10 minutes. Wasser Billig. What about Trier? That's in Germany. That's not where we want to go. Um, Pétage, that sounds French. It's in Luxembourg, but it is the right way. Okay. I think that's our best bet for now, it's Pétage. Maybe the rat is helping me. Maybe this is actually going to make their lives harder. Okay, it's 11.30. Yeah. It doesn't show him having left. I think he didn't take it. That seems conclusive. Like, because it seems to be roughly live location. Okay, he definitely did not take the train. Yeah. Wow. That is a massive relief. Petage. It's interesting. I mean, I never considered going to Petage, but this, this rat's... This rat's got an interesting strat, because the rat was like, just go west, you know? Don't don't worry about Sam's win area. Okay? Adam's going next. All you got to worry about is him. As long as you're going away from his win area, it's going to make it harder for him to get back by the end of the day. You totally got a good chance of winning, even if he got caught. I'm going to trust the rat on this one. I, I mean, I have to trust the rat on this one. That's the challenge, but... Let's just hope the rat's right. Where is he? West. What? None of this makes any sense. I think he's on that line that does that curved. Oh, he's on the curvy line. But that means he's going to like fail. Yeah, well we could even maybe just take like a taxi or something. Luxembourg is so small. All right, well, now I think Ben's... I've, I've gone from being worried Ben was about to run away with it to thinking Ben's actually in quite a lot of trouble. All right, I've decided I'm actually going to get off a little earlier. I've gone my two miles. I've fulfilled my curse. Um, that rat doesn't know what it's talking about. I think that I have to go back to Bettenberg and then down back to Metz. It seems like I'm going to just get trapped if I go to um, all the way to Batange, because uh, there are just not a lot of trains out of there. Hopefully, I'm hoping that me being kind of indecisive and going all around and having a rat factor into the equation um, will throw them off enough that they won't be able to stay, like, right on top of me. If they're even right on top of me, I don't know. It's a very nice train station. I just can't even figure out where he's going. Because he's in... He's in Etch sur, sur Alzette. We could take a 20-minute taxi there. I mean, if we were to take a taxi, we might as well take it now. But the problem is then we're potentially... In a place that there's, like, nothing. Yeah. We might be stranding ourselves. Um, oh, wait, no. There is a train to there in... Oh, it leaves in two minutes. Wait, what? Yeah, Luxembourg to Escher, Oh, okay. Platform. What, what, what train is it, Sam? It leaves in two minutes. You so twelve seventeen. The the Wasser uh, Billig one. No, it's the one to Redange. Redange. Five A B to Redange. Great. So it's Wait, up here. I don't. What? But that's a different departure time than it shows here. Well, I don't know. That's what it says. Five A B to Redange. This is five A B. Well, yeah, but does it stop at the? Oh yes, it does stop. Oh, this is out of order.
Destination Radange. Yeah. Okay. The door closed on me. Let's do it. Now it shows him north of that. Is he headed back towards us? Yeah, because it seems like he's just on the same line coming back. Jesus Christ, what is he doing? Okay, so I'm actually gonna take this train all the way up to Howald, and then I only have to be there for 10 minutes before I can transfer on a train down to Metz. Um, hopefully in that 10 minutes, they don't realize what I'm doing. Like my hope is that they think I'm going back up to Luxembourg station. And since I'm getting one station from there and I'm only there for 10 minutes, hopefully they don't realize that I stop in Howald and then go back down. Uh, and then hopefully by the time that I'm on that train back down, uh, it's too late. Yeah, so I guess if we were to go all the way to Bedenburg, he might jump us on the tracks. It's possible. I mean, he yes. left just a couple minutes before us. Yeah. I mean, he's he's closer to Bedenburg now than we are. Which means maybe we're going to want to get up at this next stop here so he doesn't jump us. We need to stop now. Let's get off. Yeah, I think so. Okay, he's definitely, he's definitely coming north. He is? Okay, so search is on. Okay, okay, so we have to get on the train and find him. The key is I think we want, there's a high chance he's trying to get off at the Luxembourg Central Station, yeah. so we need to catch him before that. Oh, it's double-decker. Uh-oh. Nice double-decker's okay. tough. What if, here, I'll take the top floor, you take the bottom floor, okay? Which direction do we go? Let's start at the, let's start at the back and go to the front. Well, that, we would need to expose ourselves right now. What? Oh, we're basically at the front. Okay. I'll take the top, you take the bottom. Station now? That's that that's station. station. If he got off, then that's one of the biggest game room moves we've ever seen. Okay, I'm here in Howald. Hopefully, they don't realize that I'm actually stopped here. Fingers crossed. He's not on the train. He must have gotten off. He's definitely, it's, he's still there and he's showing live. We just got swerved. Ben, what, 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 are, you, what are you doing? It, am I gonna pull it out? It's, is it gonna be uh, Ben victory? Well, the, the finale is up right now on Nebula. If that were true, then you could go watch right now on Nebula the finale. Wait, what, what would you watch? You could go watch the finale on Nebula right now if the finale was up right now oh, on Nebula. Oh, no, 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 Beth, guess what? I, guys, I just heard the finale is up on Nebula right now. I'm sorry, I couldn't hear you. Wait. Wait, wait, wait. I don't really believe you. Wait, what, do you, what did he say? Adam claims that the finale is up right now on Nebula. The finale? The, the finale, finale of this on, season on, on Nebula is on Nebula. You could find when? out the winner right now. Now? This very on moment. On Nebula. Oh, oh, you, what you're saying is the finale is up right now on Nebula. In other words. No, 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 no. That's not what I'm saying at all. What I'm saying is that the finale is up on Nebula right now. Oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. It makes more sense now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. I'm, I'm a little lost. Okay. Uh, Nebula is a streaming platform and it's creator-run and creator-owned. You've probably heard us talk about it if you've watched this season. 
uh, and and tell them about the deal they could get. Forty uh, percent off an annual subscription at Nebula.tv yeah, slash Jetlag, yeah. which brings costs down to under three dollars a month. And mm-hmm. every single episode of Jetlag up one week early, along with our exclusive Layover Companion podcast and our exclusive originals from a whole bunch of other creators. But I mean, I would say the biggest reason would be that the finale is uh, is on it right now. Now. Wait, yeah, it is? Now. Yeah, it's on Nebula. Holy moly. Click on that button.